Now, in this next question, we're asked to integrate x squared e to the x with respect to x, knowing this result. So, to do this, what I want to do is parts, integrate by parts again, because we've got the product of two functions of x. And so, by parts, here's the formula again, which I explained in the first part of this question. So what I'm going to do is nominate the x squared to be the u and e to the x to be dv dx. So doing this again, we have u times v, that's the first part, x squared, multiplied by the integral of the second part. So that is the integral of e to the x is e to the x. Then we have minus the integral of what we've just integrated, so that'd be minus the integral of e to the x. And then that's multiplied by the differential of u, and u is x squared, so differentiating that respect to x is 2x. So that's integrated with respect to x. Clean this up, and we have that this equals x squared e to the x minus, and I always like to put constants out the front of an integral, so that 2 will go out the front of the integral, and rearranging this we have the integral of x e to the x with respect to x. And it's at this point you should be able to see why we were given this result, because we've got the integral of x e to the x, with respect to x, and it's here. So, all we need to do then is copy the first term in, and we've got minus twice this answer up here. So we've got x e to the x minus e to the x, plus a constant. You could put the constant in there if you like. Now if we multiply this out, we have x squared e to the x minus 2x, e to the x, and then plus 2e to the x. And at this stage we have minus twice c. Well minus twice c is another constant, and I could just call that any letter I like. Capital letter would look good, I think. I'm going to call it plus k. Okay? And so that brings us then to the end of this part of the question.